Welcome to Digital Toon Time. Please click on the option of your choice. <laughs> Live from your computer, it's Digital Tune Time. Starring Wallaby Jack, Francesca Fellini, and Dagon the Terrible. And now, now because there's no better time than the present, may the adventure begin! Francesca, what's yours? Eh, uh, Jack. Uh, Wallaby Jack. Well, handsome Wallow, I need to find the Bingy Burrow Stone. Are you out of your mind? That stone is nothing but trouble. Some nasty people would like to get their hands on it. How do we find it? And where can I find a, a hairdresser? My hair is a mess. Oh, boy. Forget your hair. Come with me. Don't say a word. I'm Dagon, the bad crocodile. When I cry, beware my tears. Dagon bites. Remember that name? It'll be famous someday. The day we make Australia as cold as a cold cube of blue ice. No one can stop me. Not even you morons out there. All you've got is a tiny little mouse. I've got teeth, and I'll use them. Where are you taking me? To Kangaroo Island. Granaroo will give us some clues. An island? I hope we don't have to go by boat. It's so windy. My hair will be ruined. No, we're not going by boat. I promise. There it is. Kangaroo Island. I've got to get there before those two. I'll fool the old lady into giving me the clues. It won't be long before I get my hands on that stone. Uh-oh. Ha! It takes more than a stupid bomb to stop me. Hey, I'm invincible, so cut it out, will you? Oh, me God! I thought you said no boat. Hey, lady, this ain't no boat. Hold on. The sun's quite strong. Australian sun. The wind will ruin my hair. Australian wind. Whoa! Look behind us! I think we're being followed. 
Australian dog. I'd like you to meet Francesca. Can't you see I've got a guest? Where are my glasses? And who, pray tell, are you? What kind of people do you hang out with, Granaroo? Whom I see in my own home is none of your business. Now, what brings you to my villa? I thought you could tell me where to find the Bingy Burra Stone. Go see that old spark, Dr. Snoozleberry. He might be able to help you. He's in office 2150 at Sydney University. Well, thanks, Granaroo. Come here and give me a kiss. Much better. I wouldn't want you to catch cold. Be careful, dear. Sydney University. Hmm. Room 2150, huh? I'll find that Dr. Snoozleberry. I'll get that stone. Room 2150, huh? Maybe I'll ask this security screwball. Might I be of assistance? Mm -hmm. uh, hello, fine gentlemen. I'm Professor Dagon, famed reptilian scientist. I'm looking for my good friend, Dr. Snoozleberry. Do you have an appointment? I'm afraid he's in a meeting right now. Of course you could wait, right? Never mind, I'll find him myself. <coughs> Thanks for the help, loser. Room 2150. Do you have any idea where it might be? Oh, of course. Here it is. Show me the way to Dr. Snoozleberry's office. Just right. He's sleeping. What should we do? Wake him up. Gently. Science needs their sleep. Wake up! Wake up! 
Dr. Snoozleberry, do you think you can tell us where we might find the Bingaburra Stone? And I'm so sorry, but that information cannot be reviewed. But Professor, I came all the way from Boston, USA. Your name was given to me. What? They know about me in America. Know about you? They simply adore you, how modest you are. Everyone talks about you. They are drawing up plans as we speak to erect a statue in your honor right in the center of the city. I know the mayor personally. Well, in that case, perhaps I could be of assistance. Mm. Bingy Burra. What a great help he was. Is he really that well known? I never even heard of the guy. Oh. Well, let's go see my friend Sam. He'll know where we should go. I can't wait to see Sam. I haven't seen him in years. I hear he has kids now. Really? What a strange place to raise a family. No shopping centers or anything. Sam, it's you. This is great. Mm -hmm. Huh? How do you do? My name is Francesca. I'm Sam. How sweet. Is that one of your children? Uh-huh. That's Pip. The eleven. Eleven? How many do you have? That's Squeak. That's Squawk. This is Peep, Pop, Tic Tac, Doc, Flick, Flack, and Flock. And I'm sure there are more of them somewhere. Cute. Well, anyway, we're in a bit of a hurry. You see, ever since I've left, it's been disaster after disaster, and we're... Looking for the Bingy Burrow Stone. It's extremely important that we find... A hairdresser. I see. Let's go see my wife. She'll... Do my hair? No, I'll do that. She'll tell you where to find the stone. Follow me, kids. Stay here and behave. I've got to follow them. Funny, I smell something. Ouch! Get to the other side. Get that music box. Bring it to Wanambi. He might help you. Oh, this is so exciting! Just like in cartoons! Right! But how am I supposed to get that box? That's your problem! Why don't you just jump? You are a strong kangaroo, aren't you? Well, yes, but... No bust, Wallaby Jack. You get that box, while Sam takes care of my hair. So, who does she think she is? I can't jump that far. I don't have nine lives. A rocket! What a jolly good idea! Give me a hand, mate. Now we're talking! Thanks for the help, mate. One Ambi, here we come. What a dump! I hate this place. It gives me the creeps. One ambish, man ambish. This better be good. I don't need your help, thank you very much. It must be here. What should we do? I don't know. We don't have dragons in Boston. Well, we have to get him out of that cave. Yeah, if Sam was 
right. All I've got to do is open this here box. Well, hello, everybody. What you've been looking for isn't so hard to find. Be do be do 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 what? All you must do is set your mind to die. It isn't behind a closed door, no, what it is you're looking for is that air drop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want me to sing again? <laughs> well, as you can hear, I really love to sing. For that, my friends, is truly my thing. For whenever I have a chance, I love to croon and also dance. Oh, yeah! He isn't all that terrifying, is he? Yeah, but that doesn't help us much, does it? Sure it does. It's all in his song. He mentioned exactly where we have to go. Here's rock. I don't know why we didn't think about it before. Where else in Australia would a treasure be if not in the most commercial tourist trap? Only if that croc hasn't found it first. What croc? I've seen a kangaroo, a shark, a koala, and a bat. I haven't seen any croc. Well then, you haven't been paying attention to this story. Huh. I wonder where the stone is. Ouch! I think I stepped on a rock. That's my paw, silly. So sorry, but I just can't see anything. We need a flashlight. You! Out there in the real world. Could you click the mouse button? It'll activate the flashlight. Won't you please click the mouse button? Thanks, mate. Now, what does that say? To find the Bingy Burra Stone, follow the code. Oh, look! A code of colors! How very pretty! Dippity dingoes! There it is! It's so big! So beautiful! Well, what are you waiting for? Take it, it's yours! Uh, I'm not sure I want it anymore. You see, Wallow dear, it would never fit on a ring. And anyway, there's this great little statue in Thailand that would look simply marvelous in my parlor back home. Come on! Oh well, what can one do? Oh! Out! Hey! I need a light! Wait a minute! Here's a match! I'll get you for this! 